Paris Saint-Germain had the earliest opportunity to return to winning ways as they hosted Angers at Le Parc de Prince on Friday night. Defeated Rennes a fortnight ago ended their winning streak and the international break robbed Maurizio Pochettino once again of Neymar Jr and Lionel Messi after their participation in South America's World Cup qualifiers. Kylian Mbappe fresh from winning France the Nations League once again shouldering the attacking burden. Angers ended a four-match winless run with the last Gath victory over Metz, but despite flying high in fourth, their last victory in the capital was January 1975. Well, Paris had no shots on target against Rennes. Marco Verratti trying to set up Mauro Icardi, clashing with Pierre Capel. No penalty, at least not this time. Sofiane Buffel scored a sweet overhead kick during the international break for Morocco, helping them qualify for the African World Cup playoffs. All smiles, but no goal there. As countryman Ashraf Akimi was on the bench, Colin Dagba and the other understudies trying to prove they could step up with the big names out. Smashing across, oh, Bernardoni, smart to tip wide. Well, Mbappe strongly linked with Real Madrid next summer, while Marco Verratti wants to retire in Paris after a decade of service. But the Italian lost the ball, and it was a slow, measured build up by Sko. Paris slow to press the ball. There was no pressure on Sofia Buffal, and he picked out a sumptuous cross. Angelo Fulgini couldn't miss. The 25 years first of the season, his last goal coming, round 38 against Lille. Verratti bundled out of about Jimmy Cabo, and it ended with Gigi Donnarumma in for the injured Kayla Navas, being left exposed. And seven last term, his best ever. Fulgini one and up for the season. The fifth time at PSG in 2021 had conceded first at home in Ligue 1 Uber Eats, the most since 2012. Over 46 years since Sko had won at Le Parc, their last three visits in all competitions had resulted in 15 goals against, only one scored. PSG may have lacked inspiration, but on 69 minutes, they got themselves back on top. At the second time of asking, Mbappe finding the space to pick out on the head of Pereira. The Portuguese internationals first of the season, and despite not being anywhere near their fluent best. League and Uber Eats table toppers finally back on level terms. Paris and Angers were the two teams which had scored the most goals in the last 15 minutes in League and Uber Eats this season. That was clocked at five. That would soon become six for Paris, but in controversial circumstance. Three minutes to go, Roman Toma thought he was fouled by Mario Accardi in the build-up. Pierre Capel harshly maybe treated handball by VAR. Kylian Mbappe had failed to score in his last four Ligue 1 Uber Eats games. His longest top flight drought ending with the world champion keeping his cool for a fifth league goal of the season. Also scoring in three successive matches after netting in the Nations League semi and winner in the final. Not the first time he's done that in all competitions since May. Angers furious with the late decision that denied them a point for the first time in 40 years in the capital. Paris back to winning ways, but nothing spectacular and hoping for stars to return ahead of hosting RB Leipzig in the Champions League on Tuesday night.